Are you watching this video with a newborn? You probably don't remember the last time you slept well enough. If you are an expectant parent, you are probably terrified of what you hear about the sleep situation of new parents. All of it is true. With a newborn, you do not sleep enough. You are grumpy and depressed. Your relationship with your partner is becoming rocky. Here are some tips and tricks that recent mothers have sworn by. 1. Swaddle your baby. All nans will tell you that, but swaddle your baby only when they are sleeping, which will be most of the time in the beginning. That way, when your baby is swaddled and wrapped, he or she knows it's time to doze off. The reason swaddling works is because your baby is wrapped up in your womb before coming into the world. There is not as much room to move. It is startling for them to come into this world and break free. Being swaddled makes them feel like they are being held. 2. White noise White noise works like magic when you start early. It's because when your baby is in the womb, the outside world sounds like white noise to them. They associate this noise with being protected and cozy inside your womb. 3. Bath Bathing babies at bedtime lowers their body temperature. If you massage them for a few minutes with organic oils, it makes them relaxed and aids their sleep. Here is what you should not do when you want your baby to sleep. 1. Rock them it's easier to do that in the first few weeks. They have a small weight, but as they grow up and become heavier, it becomes more difficult to lift them for a long time, let alone rock them. Even if you rock them in their crib, it can be really hard to break the habit in the long term. 2. Bring them to bed 70% of sudden infant death syndrome has been caused by having your baby sleep in your bed. Yes, you can be very responsible and careful, and no one doubts that. But as a new parent, you are functioning on very little sleep, which is the equivalent of being drunk. It is extremely unsafe to bring your infants to bed, and you should avoid it at all costs. 3. Have a warm room The ideal temperature of a room for a baby is 15 to 20 degrees depending on the weather. Anything more or less has also been the cause of SIDS. Research has shown that babies sleep better when the temperature around them is slightly on the cooler side. That's all from us today. Hope you found this video useful and your little one starts sleeping better. If you like this video, please like and share it with your friends and subscribe to our channel.